The United Arab Emirates national football team Arabic, represents the United Arab Emirates in association football and is controlled by the United Arab Emirates Football Association, the governing body for football in United Arab Emirates and competes in AFC. They were for a time managed by legendary English manager Don Revy. United Arab Emirates home ground varies. Most home games have been played at Sheikh Zayed Stadium in Abu Dhabi with Abu Dhabi's Al Jazeera Stadium and Haza bin Zayed Stadium in Al Ain as other venues. It has made one World Cup appearance, in 1990 in Italy, but lost all three of its games to Colombia, West Germany and Yugoslavia. Two years later, the United Arab Emirates took fourth place in the 1992 Asian Cup, and runner-up in 1996 as hosts of the tournament. In both tournaments, their final match was lost on penalty kicks. They also won the Arabian Gulf Cup on two occasions, in 2007 when they won the title for the first time in their history, and the second time was in 2013. They finished third in the 2015 AFC Asian Cup and will be hosting the next AFC Asian Cup in 2019. History Early years The first match of the United Arab Emirates national football team was played on 17 March 1972, four months after the Union of the United Arab Emirates. They played against Qatar at Riyadh's Prince Faisal bin Fahd Stadium and UAE won 1–0 with the only goal scored by Ahmed Chaoubi. Then, the team faced three other Arabian countries, losing 4–0 and 7–0 to Saudi Arabia and Kuwait respectively and beating Bahrain 3–0. After participating in four Gulf Cup tournaments since 1972, the United Arab Emirates hosted the 1982 edition. They again finished third, as they did in the two previous tournaments. First Asian Cup appearances. In 1980, the United Arab Emirates qualified for the first time for the AFC Asian Cup, which was held in Kuwait. They were drawn with eventual winners, Kuwait, runner-up South Korea, Malaysia and Qatar in Group B. They drew 1-1 with Kuwait but lost the three other matches and finished their first appearance at the tournament in fifth place in their group and ninth out of ten teams overall. They also qualified for next two tournaments, 1984 in Singapore and 1988 in Qatar and were again eliminated in the group stages in both. Their first victory of the tournament occurred against India on 7 December 1984 under manager Heshmet Mohajirani. Topic: 1990 FIFA World Cup in Italy In 1984, Mohajirani resigned as UAE head coach and was replaced with former Brazil manager Carlos Alberto Pereira. Pereira led the country at the 1988 AFC Asian Cup and left his position after the tournament. He was succeeded by Brazilian World Cup winning coach Mario Zagallo. Zagallo led the country to the qualification for the 1990 FIFA World Cup in Italy. However, Zagallo resigned before the tournament and Pereira returned as head coach to lead the United Arab Emirates at the tournament. They were drawn at Group D along with eventual winner West Germany, Colombia and Yugoslavia. They lost 2-0 to Colombia, 5-1 to West Germany and 4-1 to Yugoslavia. They finished fourth with no points, scoring two goals and conceding 11 goals. UAE's first goal at the tournament was scored by Khalid Ismail against West Germany. After the tournament, Pereira was sacked. Two years later, at the 1992 AFC Asian Cup, the United Arab Emirates finished in fourth place, their best finish up to that date. 1996 AFC Asian Cup The United Arab Emirates hosted the 1996 AFC Asian Cup. They hired Croatian coach Tomislav Ivic one year before the tournament and were drawn in Group A along with Kuwait, South Korea and Indonesia. They drew 1-1 with South Korea in the opening match, then defeated Kuwait 3-2 and Indonesia 2-0 to qualify as group winners with seven points. 
In the quarter-finals, they beat Iraq 1–0 with a golden goal scored by Abdul Rahman Ibrahim in the 103rd minute in extra time. They again faced Kuwait, this time at the semi-finals and won 1–0 to qualify to the final for the first time. In the final, and after a goalless draw, they lost to Saudi Arabia 2–4 in a penalty shootout and finished the tournament as runner-up, which is still their best finish in the AFC Asian Cup. The tournament was also considered to be one of the best tournaments held since 1956. The tournament had an average 3.08 goals per game with 80 goals scored, 49 goals higher than the previous edition. The United Arab Emirates also appeared in the 1997 FIFA Confederations Cup after being awarded a spot because Asian winners Saudi Arabia was hosting the games. They lost the first match 2-0 to Uruguay. Then, they defeated South Africa 1-0. In their final match, they were defeated 6-1 by Czech Republic and missed their chance to qualify for the next round finishing third in their group. Dark years Despite their good performances at the previous Asian Cup, the United Arab Emirates missed the qualification for the 2000 AFC Asian Cup in Lebanon. They also finished in last place at the 2002 Gulf Cup in Saudi Arabia. They were eliminated in the next three AFC Asian Cup tournaments at the group stage. Their worst performance was in 2011 when they finished the tournament goalless. At this time, many notable coaches managed the United Arab Emirates, including Carlos Queiroz, Roy Hodgson and Dick Advocat. In 2006, the UAE appointed Senegal's 2002 FIFA World Cup head coach, Bruno Metsu as their new manager. He led the United Arab Emirates to the 2007 Gulf Cup title, the country's first major achievement. Recent successes After hiring many notable European coaches, in 2012, the United Arab Emirates appointed the Olympic team coach Mahdi Ali as the new manager of the national team. Ali previously led the country to their first ever appearance at the Olympic Games. Ali began creating a young squad for the United Arab Emirates, inviting many players that he had worked with at youth level. He led the United Arab Emirates to their second Gulf Cup title in 2013. Topic: 2015 AFC Asian Cup. The United Arab Emirates's form at the 2015 AFC Asian Cup was a surprise to many. They were drawn in Group C along with Iran, Qatar, and Bahrain. They defeated Qatar 4-1 in their first match. At the next match, they defeated Bahrain 2-1, which qualified them for the knockout stage. In the group's final game, the United Arab Emirates lost 1-0 to Iran, in which Iran scored a controversial goal that appeared to be offside. However, the Gulf team advanced as group runner-up. They faced the defending champions Japan in the quarterfinal and earned a shock victory on penalties to advance to the last four. However, they lost 2-0 to the host country Australia in the semi-finals. In the third-place playoff, they beat Iraq 3-2 and finished the tournament in the third place. The United Arab Emirates will be hosting the 2019 AFC Asian Cup. Topic: 2018 FIFA World Cup qualification. The United Arab Emirates qualified for the second round of the AFC qualification, where they finished second in Group A behind Saudi Arabia and qualified for the third round. In this round, they finished fourth in Group B, thus failing to qualify for the 2018 FIFA World Cup. Despite this, one of United Arab Emirates players Ahmed Khalil managed to be the top scorer in the qualification along with two other players. <laughs> 2019 AFC Asian Cup In 2015, it was announced that the United Arab Emirates will host the 2019 AFC Asian Cup. This marks the second time United Arab Emirates hosts an AFC Asian Cup. First was in 1996 AFC Asian Cup where UAE finished in second place after losing Saudi Arabia on penalties. Topic: <inaudible> <inaudible> Rivalries. 
UAE's main rivals are its neighbors Saudi Arabia, Qatar, Oman, Bahrain, Kuwait, Iraq and Iran. It also has a rivalry with Uzbekistan. Topic: <laughs> Qatar The rivalry between Qatar and UAE was mostly friendly but in recent years both countries have been more aggressive to each other and this resulted in players in both teams disrespecting each other in the pitch due to political tensions. As a result both national teams have been never been friendly towards each other and captain of the UAE youth team have refused to shake hands with Qatar's youth captain. As of 2018 they have played 29 official matches, most of which was held competitively in the Arabian Gulf Cup. It started off with the United Arab Emirates beating Qatar 1-0. They only played two friendly games and the last friendly was held in 2011 which ended with an Emirati victory. Nicknames <inaudible> 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 The United Arab Emirates is known by supporters and the media as Al Abayad, meaning the white jersey and also Isle Zayed which means Zayed Sons. In October 2012, the Asian Football Confederation official website published an article about the UAE national team's campaign to qualify for the 2015 AFC Asian Cup, in which the team was referred to as the Sand Monkeys. This was the indirect result of vandalism of the Wikipedia article on the team, and the AFC was forced to apologize for what was perceived as a racist slur. <laughs> Home stadium UAE's main national stadium is Sheikh Zayed Stadium, located in capital Abu Dhabi. However, UAE has also used Mohammed bin Zayed Stadium, Al Jazeera Stadium, and has a bin Zayed Stadium in Al Ain. Topic: Historical kits. Topic: Coaching staff. Topic Players Topic Current Squad The following players were called up for Yemen Match date, the twentieth of November twenty eighteen. Topic Recent call ups The following players have also been called up to the United Arab Emirates squad within the last 12 months. Recent and forthcoming fixtures Topic 2017 Topic twenty eighteen. Topic twenty nineteen. Topic Tournament records. Topic FIFA World Cup record. Asterisk denotes draws include knockout matches decided on penalty kicks. Topic <laughs> AFC Asian Cup record. Topic <laughs> <laughs> FIFA Confederations Cup record. Topic. <laughs> Asian Games record Football at the Asian Games has been an under-23 tournament since 2002. <inaudible> Arabian Gulf Cup record <inaudible> Pan-Arab Games record Uh, 
Topic: <laughs> Palestine Cup of Nations. Palestine Cup of Nations. Topic: <laughs> Head to head against other countries. As of the 20th of November 2018, positive record, neutral record, negative record. Topic: Records. Active players are shown in bold. As of October 11, 2018. Topic: Honors. Major competitions AFC Asian Cuprunner Up 1, 1996 Third place 1, 2015 Fourth place 1, 1992 Arabian Gulf Cup Winners 2, 2007, 2013 Runner Up 4, 1986, 1988, 1994, 2017 Third place 5, 1972, 1976, 1982, 1998, 2014 minor competitions Kieran Cup winners 1, 2005 OSN Cup winners 1, 2013 See also Football in the United Arab Emirates United Arab Emirates Women's National Football Team United Arab Emirates National Under-23 Football Team United Arab Emirates National Under-20 Football Team United Arab Emirates National Under-17 Football Team, Under 17 football team.